Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am It's Roxanne and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing season 2 episode 11 of Sword Art Online Affiliation called Heartless Choice. So we have the book Coley flashback with the point effects about death and then an alarm went off. And then Vetta is being more creative and um, the fighters are using ropes to get across the big ravine to get to the other side. And uh, when the alarm goes off, you know, the, the Human Empire team, um, they get rid of the ropes and the fighters get really mad about it because they see it as kind of pointless. Then it's July 7th, 2026. And basically what they did was Yui um, is now, this game got switched from its fast paced world to that is on the same time as the real world and that it's open to the public and it's um, very for peak time for the Americans to use. So what um, Vepta did was he created this whole like thing where you can log into the game and just go ham on these people. They encouraged the offing of people and all the things. So UA is informed of this and she warns everyone about that. So um, the Wraith is informed. So they are going. <laughs> Uh, so Yui uh, gives a speech and they can't convert Rake into the game. So Elizabeth talks to everyone in um, LAO and lists the risk of people in there. And people are really mad. It's like, like, da da da, like, you can't do this. Like, why should I care about this person? Whatever. So she turns it around and, you know, um, basically says, like, look, like, we are monitored every single day because we are associated to, as a risk because we were trapped in that game for two years like we're in a special school we gotta do all these things so it's not like we just like turn around and do nothing like we're going to do something about this because it's very important to us and it's just actually getting her message across i feel like but then in the um back into the world the americans log in and they go batshit <laughs> literally in the game and that's the end of the episode um I really enjoyed the episode. I thought it was really good, so I gave this an A plus because I like Lisbeth's um, speech and how at first she was like she was not grabbing the people at all, but she managed to turn around and give like a very empowering speech. And I really, really enjoyed that. And um, we also see a little bit of the fighters starting to change their minds about how they feel about Vetta and everything. So they're starting to think of like a workaround and stuff because um, I, I was really, really interesting on how that's starting to happen. Like there's just little echoes of it. It's not like full on yet. So um, I really, really am enjoying this, um, this series, even though it's hella violent. <laughs> First of all, if you're under the age, it's rated MA. So that's on you, <laughs> but it's a, it's a crazy show, but I, I really enjoy it. And that's one do for this video. So this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell what you think of the episode, do you agree, disagree, just tell me your thoughts down below and don't forget to subscribe because it does help out the channel a lot. And I'll see y'all in my next video because I'll be posting a lot more and I'll have stuff scheduled for like weeks. It's going to be crazy. I got like 40 videos to publish. So I'm scheduling it all out. Um, this will have, this will come first. Then I'll be jumping back into Pokemon, um, and so I'm in Crystal, I'll be just jumping into all the shows, um, I'm pretty sure I got them recorded and done, I just got to literally publish, the, um, schedule them and publish them. So, um, I got a lot of free time right now, so, anyway, that's it, um, subscribe if you want, and I'll see you in my next video, bye.